Hello YouTube, how's everybody? Today is Wednesday, February 17, 2016 and as promised, this is week 1 follow-up video report on my Boulevard Positioner's Watch Accuracy Test right here is a Boulevard Positioner's Watch that I got exactly one week ago and what's special about this uh, Boulevard Positioner's Movement is that even though it is a coarse movement, it vibrates at roughly eight times the vibrational frequency of a regular quartz watch. So as such, at 262,000 cycles per second, Bolovar claims that it is extremely accurate, much more accurate than a regular quartz watch. Bolovar claims accuracy of within 10 seconds a year versus 15 seconds a month or 3 minutes a year accuracy of a regular quartz watch. So you got 10 seconds a year versus 3 minutes a year on accuracy. That is a huge jump. So to find out if that is true, I have decided to do a accuracy test against my Citizens Atomic Watch. This is one is my reference watch because it receives atomic uh, the atomic time from four columns. It's synchronized by radio waves, so it's always accurate. Now these two watches were synchronized exactly one week ago. This one I add on just to make it interesting. I synchronized about three days ago. Now as far as I can tell. The second hand are exactly right on, dead on, for all three watches. However, in close inspection, it appears that the minute hand of this one is just a tad slower than this one. Now, I don't know if it's because of angle, camera angle, or what. But the second hand has been ex exactly right. Now it could be that when I synchronize these two watches, there was a little human error in in uh, in the se uh, minute hand. Now we'll keep checking every week to see if that gets bigger. The difference gets bigger. But uh, but right now, all three watches are dead on spot on in accuracy. Now sometimes the camera angle can make it appear that the time is slightly off. But I've been checking the second hand of, of this watch versus this watch. They have always been exactly the same. So I think the minute hand discrepancy is uh, human error when I synchronize the watch. But we'll see. So this is uh, after one week of synchronization, and uh, so far, all uh, the, these two watches are extremely accurate, as accurate as the atomic watch. However, given more time, the difference could show up. So please check back in one week for the week two report. Thank you for watching, and good evening.